What's this joke? This place is called Froggyland. As long as it's not full of frogs, then I'm absolutely fine. Uh, that's disgusting. There's 507 here. <laughs> Froggyland is home to 21 scenes of everyday life from 100 years ago. But with frogs. Holy moly! <laughs> <gasps> They're real frogs. These started being made in 1910 by a man called Ferenc Mere. Sorry, could you ribbit that, please? Stop. It took him 10 years, and he started in 1910. You know, most of the world worried about World War I, but Ferenc had to make a thousand stuffed frogs, 507 of which are in this building. Would you like to know a bit about the process? Uh, yeah. There's no incisions on any of these frogs. Basically, to stuff them, you just put loads of cork in their mouths, just shoved corks into their gobs. You know, in things like CSI Miami, it'd be the sort of storyline where they were like, there's no incisions on any of these frogs. It's like they've been stuffed through the mouth with the cork. <laughs> If this is how you were going to go, which one do you think you'd be? I don't want to be the one that's uh, suspended in the air because I feel like I'd never get to just relax. Mm. Maybe the guy having the, the lean with, the, with his little drum and bong thing. Which one would you be, Joe, if you were to be any of the dead frogs? I would be this Yeah, guy. you would absolutely, top or bottom? Bottom. <laughs> okay. For any curious reviewers. <laughs> <laughs> Love places like this. I absolutely do. And yeah. I'm going to keep that for the rest of the week. Mm. Wow, amazing. Mm.